If you have ever stared at your family tree and felt like you were unraveling a bowl of spaghetti, you're not alone. Today we're diving into a creative and surprisingly simple solution to those tangled family lines using Canva. Yep, that same tool you might use for flyers or Instagram posts can also totally transform how you visualize complex family relationships. Let's break it down step by step. I got a message last week from a viewer named Emily. She said, I've got duplicate names, cousin marriages, and some serious pedigree collapse. My tree software just turns it into a tangled mess. Help! Emily, this one's for you, and everyone else who's ever tried to make sense of a loop-de-loop -loop family tree. Choosing Canva for visualizing complex trees. Now you might be thinking, why Canva? Well, unlike tree software that auto-generates based on rigid rules, Canva gives you total creative control. You can draw outside the box, literally. Move people around, highlight odd relationships, and finally see what's going on. Starting your Canva family tree with the organizational chart template. All right, let's get hands on. Instead of starting from scratch, we're going to cheat a little smartly. Canva has a built-in organizational chart template and it's perfect for laying out your family tree in a neat, structured way. Just go to Canva and type organizational chart in the search bar. Pick one that has simple boxes and lines, avoid the overly colorful ones at first, because we'll customize everything. Once you're inside the editor, think of each box as a person. The top box? That could be your most distant known ancestor or a root couple. You can easily duplicate boxes, move them around, and relabel them with names, birth years, and other details. Now here's where Canva shines. You're not locked into a rigid layout like in some genealogy programs. Want to add an extra spouse? Just duplicate a box and shift it to the side. Want to expand sideways instead of down? Go for it. Treat each generation like a row in your org chart. Align siblings next to each other and keep parent-child connections clean and evenly spaced. And if you ever need more room, just zoom out or extend the canvas. This approach gives you the structure of a tree but the flexibility of a whiteboard. Perfect for untangling those messy family webs, aligning and connecting family members. Now for the fun part, line them up. Use Canva's smart guides to align people horizontally by generation and vertically by sibling order. Use simple lines to connect parents to children, managing overlapping ancestors and pedigree collapse. Where Canva really shines. Let's say you've got cousins who married each other or multiple lines leading back to the same ancestor. In traditional tree software, that usually creates spaghetti lines. But in Canva, you can just duplicate that ancestor's box, place them near the second branch, and use dashed lines or color codes to indicate that it's the same person. Using Family Search for Relationship Clarity. When things get especially confusing, I like to hop over to Family Search. They have a cool feature that shows how you are related to someone through different lines. Grab those paths and use them to build your canvas map with more clarity. Advanced techniques, elbow lines, and spouse links. If you've got people marrying across generations or family groups, elbow lines are your best friend. These are lines that bend at a 90 degree angle to keep things readable. Color coding family lines for better visualization. Color coding is a total game changer. Use different colors for each main family line. Maybe your mom's side is blue, dad's side is green, and cousin marriages get red highlights. Suddenly, that mess of lines becomes way easier to follow, adding visual notes for key ancestors. Want to remember which ancestor was in the Civil War or who came over on the Mayflower? Add a little note next to their box or even a tiny image or icon. Final tips for using Canva to simplify complex trees. Before we wrap up, a few pro tips. Use Canva's grouping tool to move whole branches easily. Zoom out often to see the big picture. Save different versions of your tree as your understanding grows. And don't worry about making it perfect, just aim for clarity. Why Canva beats traditional tree software for complex lines? Look, I love tree software for storing facts and sources, but when it comes to understanding how it all fits together, Canva wins. It's flexible, intuitive, and honestly kind of fun, especially when you're dealing with duplicate ancestors, cousin loops, or custom visuals. 
If you found this helpful, give it a thumbs up and share it with your fellow family detectives. And I'd love to see your Canva trees drop a link or a screenshot in the comments. Until next time, keep those branches tidy and your roots strong.